Imagine stepping into a helicopter simulator and within one hour, you're already flying a real autonomous Blackhawk. It may sound like science fiction, but that's exactly what soldiers from the Army National Guard did recently, thanks to some cutting edge technology from Sikorsky. In this first of its kind demonstration at Fort Campbell, Kentucky, soldiers who had zero previous flight experience piloted a UH-60 Blackhawk equipped with Sikorsky's Matrix Autonomy System with nothing more than a tablet. During the demonstration, the Garthman piloted a Blackhawk with a 2,900-pound water buffalo sling loaded under it, conducted simulated medevacs, and transported troops. So what's the goal of all of this? The Army is trying to prove that autonomous systems can make aviation more accessible, safer, and mission-ready. On the battlefield, this new technology could be a real game-changer, as more aerial missions could be conducted in contested areas where it may have previously been too unsafe to fly. This demonstration also highlighted the potential for soldiers to operate complex aircraft with minimal training. This opens the door for future battlefield operations. And as the autonomy technology evolves, the Army is envisioning a future where humans and machines can team up to enhance flexibility and survivability. But what do you guys think about all of this? Do autonomous and semi-autonomous aircraft have a place in today's military? Let me know.